Hi, Best Buds. It's Kathy with Kathy's Garden, and I'm so happy that you've joined me today. Today, we're going to use these adorable chipboard, I think they're called chipboard, houses, and we're going to make some clusters with them. But first, let's have our shout out to Sherry, CDNQ Grandma, Susie Susu, Black Coffee, Julie, Judy, Susan, Lenny, Paula, Kelly, and Leanne. I appreciate each and every one of you. All right, I just thought these little houses were absolutely adorable. Now, I don't know if they still have them. I know they have different types of chipboard. I purchased, actually purchased the, these at Walmart last year. It came on a card like this. It had six little ornaments. They were called ornaments. It was in the Christmas section. At that time last year, they were $1.98. I have no idea if they still sell them and how much they are, but I did see um, this year that they did have lots of different types of things like this that they were selling. So I have prepped once again, and I have some music paper that I've torn into pieces and inked around the edge. I have some coffee dyed tissue paper that I've done the same with inked around the edge and torn them. I have some little roses that are on wire stems right here. I have six of the bows that I've prepped and made ahead of time. I have some lace rectangles here, red lace rectangles. These are from digitalcollage.com. They're little hearts and I've gone ahead and fussy cut them and inked around the edge. I have some cardstock here. It is, I used my punch and then I inked around the edge only because I don't plan on showing these, but just in case if the edge pops through or something, it'll be ready and coffee dyed. And of course, we have our feature of the clusters, these adorable little houses. Let's get going. So what I wanna do first is I wanna start with my base. So here's my base. Let's bring in a piece of music right here, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use my uh, Tombow glue, and I'm going to actually, oh goodness, I need to add some more glue, I think. I'm going to add my glue right on my base. I'm going to load it up with some glue here, just like this, and I'm going to take my music paper, and I'm going to lay it maybe something like that. So it's kind of almost right in the middle of it. Like I said, I don't plan on this to be showing. So anyway, here we go. Now the tissue paper. I thought that I could maybe place it, I'm not sure yet, maybe somewhere like here. And I want that music paper to pop through the tissue paper. I think that's very pretty. So I'm actually just going to put a small amount right here, right in the middle, and I'm going to put it at an angle, maybe something like that. All right. The next thing what I want to do is I'm going to select a house, and we're going to get it on here. I'm going to get myself a piece of lace, and I'm going to actually trim the edges of this lace. So I'm just folding it so the edges touch the corners, touch like this, I bring in my scissors and I'm just going to kind of round the corners off a little bit just so it's not so severe. And I'd like to maybe stick my house, I don't know if I want it crooked or straight, maybe something like this. Before I put that down, I want to select heart. And I'd like to stick my heart, I think I want it on top like that, or do I want it on the bottom? Somewhere I want to stick my little heart on here. Oh, that's pretty cute over there. That's pretty cute. All right, how about if we do something like that? So I'm just going to peel this off a little bit. I'm going to switch to my hot glue, and I'm just going to glue that down. I'm going to lay my lace. I think it was about like that. There we go. Now I'm going to add quite a bit of my hot glue onto my 
little house, the back of my little house, and I'm going to press it down firmly so it really grabs a hold nicely. Oh my goodness, isn't that cute? These would be adorable on a journal cover. Absolutely precious. So let's see here. Let, I'm going to bring in my wire cutters, and I'm just going to cut myself off. A rose and I'm actually leaving a little bit of a stem because it'll fit right in there just like that and lay flat actually just a tiny bit more there we are now I'm just going to put some hot glue on the back of my little flower I'm going to stick it right in that hole right there I think that's going to be cute and I've got my bow that I've already made and let's see about getting that maybe placed, I'm not real sure, maybe right along the side, maybe along this side, I'm not sure exactly where, maybe just down below, How about right here on this corner. I think that's where I just like to stick it right there. Oh my goodness, I think these are absolutely adorable so cute right so let's go ahead and let's do one more so i've got my base and i'm going to get my music let's go ahead and maybe lay it way over to the side i'm going to stick with this hot glue right here and i'm just going to glue that onto the base so it's you've got something to attach it to your whatever it is that you're putting your cluster on you have some piece that's sturdy that you can attach your cluster. So a piece of tracing paper. Let's maybe move it up high. Now I am going to bring in my Tombow glue and I'm going to use the Tombow glue on my tracing paper just like this. Okay and then let's see here. Let's bring in our piece of lace. I'm going to fold it with the corners touching, fold it over like this, and give it just a little trim just to take off the, the corners there. And let's do a short one. A little short one's cute. So how about if we place it about right there? And I'm just going to add a little bit of glue. I'm going to add some glue onto the back of my house. And place it right down just like that. Forgot my little heart though, didn't I? I can have my heart popping out that way. Let's see. Let's see. How do I want this heart? cute. I do want it to show though. I wonder. I have no idea. Let's just see. That'll, that'll fit right in there just fine. Just like that. I am going to go ahead and ink it though. That would be important. Okay, let's go ahead and get this glued on there. Just like that. Oh my goodness, look how cute. So cute. Now, a little bow. Maybe right down here. Maybe right up here. How about that? Let's put it up above. Let's put it right here. Just like that. That's cute too. Oh my goodness. I know we haven't even gotten to Christmas yet and I'm already thinking ahead. <laughs> this would be adorable for a, a February journal absolutely adorable. 
look at there oh my goodness you guys if you have enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up i invite you to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in my next video i'll see you there guys bye now